Hello, my darlings. It's Dion Dean back with another makeup video. I've really been enjoying doing these videos with you guys because now I have people <laughs> that I can talk to while I'm doing my makeup and share my love of makeup. Or if you're just getting into makeup, I'm so excited um, that you're allowing me to kind of like share my love with you. All right. So today I got these two Juvia, Juvia's Place um, palettes. Juvia's Place is a black owned brand um, and they just do some really great palettes. They have a website, juviasplace.com and they're also um, um, featured or carried at Ulta. I got these on the website. They were having a sale $10 for each palette. And so I was like, I, I had to get it. And I'll show you the specific palette that I got that I'm really excited about and I'll tell you why. Um, first things first, what's on my face, I'm wearing my Tarte Double Duty Foundation and this is in 51N Deep Neutral. They are really, really, and of course, you guys know I use the Shape Tape Concealer. And so these working together are just, really, it's just a really great foundation. I got this in deep, I'll peep this out because I'm gonna use it. Um, so I got the Tarte Shape Tape or the Shape Tarte Face Tape. If you guys want me to do a um, foundation collection, I definitely will, because um, I have a lot. This is like one of my favorites, Pat McGrath, but I have like five or six foundations. So if you want me to do a video, let me know. And then on the eyebrow, I have the Brow Styler, Brow Stylist Definer um, from L'Oreal, but I'll leave a link to what I'm using below. So let's get into the palettes really quickly because I don't want to make this a really long video because Riley is watching Doc McStuffins and she will be quick to bust up in here when it's done. So the first palette that I wanted to get, sorry, I already took it out of the packaging. This is the Queen palette, Fumi and Juvia's Place. I want to say that Fumi, I don't know her last name, please forgive me. She is a beauty vlogger or a lifestyle vlogger, lifestyle influencer, um, but her palette was beautiful. So it was on my list of makeup um, palettes to get. And so what I'm really interested in is this pink and the, I actually were just in, interested in all of them and like doing a look with these two or like the pink and the bronzy color. Really excited about that. So there's that palette. But what I really got this for was the Zulu palette. And I think there's, I think there's like three Zulu palettes. Um, but what I'm really interested in is recreating, and look at this, oh, I've been waiting to crack this open. What I'm really interested in is getting into this turquoise color and this purple, um, possibly this yellow. You guys saw last week we did a look with, what palette was it? Was it this palette? Where I was really, this is the Morphe Boss Mood 35M palette. You guys saw me experiment with this, with the green and the purple. So a purple, one of these purples this is one of them. I'll link the video up here. I want to see how this purple, the pigment in this purple, how it performs. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to, let's do this purple and this green with our Fenty, what's it called? With the Fenty pencil, the fly pencil. Do we dare? Let's do it. Let's do it, let's play around. All right, so before we get started, let us put something, I use concealer. Um, you guys can use um, eyeshadow primer. I use, I use concealer, I've always used concealer. Um, you have to use concealer. That's a note that you want to make to yourself. When you have these really pigmented um, uh, eyeshadows or, oh, sorry. When you have these really pigmented shadows, a lot of times they will stain the eyelid. And so if you don't put something between, if you don't put a primer on a barrier on, um, underneath it'll stain your lid and so I'm thinking that this will that this will stain my lid all right so what do we want to do first I'm going to I'm going to put this color here in my crease that's what I'm going to do so and once again stop the video go get your makeup and let's play together okay Ooh, sorry. Let's play together. Sorry, my battery's going low. All right. So let's do this. So let's go in the crease with this color here. 
okay and if you have something like this at home you don't you definitely do not have to go out and buy something you just don't um if you are a makeup lover and you enjoy it then you absolutely do you absolutely can go get it and don't let anybody make you feel bad for that i spent so many years feeling not dumb what's the word irresponsible for buying makeup i mean when i was younger i spent most of my money and you guys know i got my nail license when i was 17 um and that really came from my dad saying you are just spending too much time on this beauty stuff you need to go get jamaican in them you need to go get make this a trade you need to make this a trade so i got my nail license but i used to feel very guilty um and my aunts and other family members made me feel like i was stupid for doing that and i'm like you know what i'm a grown woman i can do what i want now all right so how do we do, how do we attack this let us put the purple on first i'm going to use you guys have asked me about the artiste brushes this is a digit circle i want to say that this is the crease brush i'm going to try it i've never i've never tried this brush it is clean but let's go ahead and see oh it's actually really nice do we see the purple okay we see a little bit of the purple i'm gonna try it with the like my usual brush to see if i see any difference i i'm gonna be honest and say i don't know how to use this particular brush i'm using it the way that feels natural to me so there's the purple. Let me use, let me use this crease brush to see if there's a difference in application. And I'm staying very, very much in this kind of socket place right here. Hmm. I don't think I'm being as liberal when I have this brush. I feel like I did more over here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use this because this is very safe. I'm gonna I'm gonna do something new, guys. I'm going to use this brush the way that it feels natural to me to use. <laughs> the purple seems to be. You guys see it? Okay, all right, and we'll clean we'll clean this up with some concealer. All right, so the proof is gonna be in this turquoise. Do we want to do turquoise or do we want to do green? Let's do. Or do we want to do yellow? No, let's do. I should have brought my other brush. I have another brush that I think might be better for this, but it's outside. All right. So out of my comfort zone. Okay. Oh. Okay. It's out of my comfort zone, but you know what? Who cares? Let's do it. Let's do it. Critical aunties be darned. If you've never had a critical auntie, then you may be you may be listening to me like what? But we've all had those people that just make you feel dumb. Whether it's an auntie, uh, a, a, a boss. Some of us got some spouses. Can I get an amen? <laughs> I'm blessed. Um, my spouse is supportive, but I, I know there's some men out there that are not and will make you feel like crap for being you. The devil knew I was hitting a nerve. He interrupted that. <laughs> All right. But um, yeah, the critical aunties. Let's, let's show them the green eye, y'all. I really like what it's doing in here with the purple. Oh, I like that. It kind of turned pink on us. Let's do this. And you know what? I love when I watch these looks. When this palette came out, not when it came out, but I've seen people do looks with this palette. And I just, I think they're gorgeous. But I'm like, I can never do that. Well, guess what, guys? I'm doing it. We're doing it, right? love this okay so let's get right in there 
I hear Riley jumping on the couch, y'all. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear it. She is having a good time while mommy's not there to yell at her. I really like that. So what I am going to do is I am going to take this brush now and I'm gonna go, I'm gonna dip into this purple and this um, rusty kind of color. I'm gonna mix them and I feel like I need to just go in lightly and just make sure that that's kind of blended. Yeah, you saw what I did there? I just wanna make sure that it's kind of, yeah, blended. <laughs> the reason why people that do makeup or makeup artists do this is to tap off the excess. So I just wanna lightly, lightly just, I love what that has done. Do you see that? That is so pretty. All right, so, all right, let us, let me, con no, let me not conceal yet. So what I wanna do is I want to put on this, um, the fly pencil. Oh my gosh, it's not finished, is it? Oh my God, I just got it. <laughs> it can't be finished yet. So I'm gonna put that on in here. And this is like a true blue. It's not turquoise, it's really like a blue. <laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> Oh, my eyes. Okay. I mean, Dion, if you're going to do it, do it. Okay, come on. All right, let's go in here. That's so cool. I love this. So outside of my comfort zone, guys. <laughs> it's so funny because growing up, all my girlfriends were going to MAC, um, which MAC starts for makeup cosmetics. And so that's why you see a lot of makeup artists that come from MAC can just do amazing looks because MAC is, it's, it was made for those amazing theatrical looks. I was always like the Bobby Brown girl. So I was always in like nude, 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 brown, brown, nude, brown. I was never this girl. I really like it. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's, um, let's go, let's go into this one right here this needs to be clean forgive me guys let's go into this color here and go into that lower lash line to smoke it out a little bit I don't know how this is gonna look guys okay <laughs> oops sorry got my mouth all open I don't know how this is gonna look but Do we even see a difference? We see a little bit of a difference. Oh, I got a, something in my eye here. All right. Let's do that again over here. Look at me. Okay. Okay. Let's clean it up a little bit with the concealer. So you don't want to go like up into the eye. I'm just cleaning up. Okay, let's do this one over here. Clean this up. I think this came out pretty well, guys. What do you think? How are you guys doing at home, for those of you that have joined me? How are you guys doing? I think it looks good. I think I'm gonna do a live makeup thing. And you guys grab your makeup bags and we just play in makeup. <laughs> wear looks that we'd never wear otherwise. <laughs> this quarantine has brought out the best of us, right? Okay really brightened up my eye all right so we're gonna go into my bad gal bang which is my favorite mascara oh gosh is it running out do I need to get one? Oh lord all right here we go this and Marc Jacobs are my two favorites I have the Dior one in there but I just have not really like worked it I'm going to I'm going to work it on a day when I'm not recording a makeup tutorial to see how I like it. Right now this is my favorite. And Lash Paradise by L'Oreal is my other favorite. That's a good drugstore one. Okay. 
All right. Okay, so down here we really need to make sure that we get some stuff on the lash so that it just doesn't look like we have like blue lashes, which is fine if that's who you want to be. All right, so how does that look? I think it looks really cool, guys. What do you guys think? I like it. I really like it. Okay, I'm sorry. I know, I know. We've talked about this, me and my love of mascara. <laughs> We've talked about this. All right, let's do one. Let's do the other eye. You see why I love this mascara? It's like amazing. Okay, I really like this eye, guys. Oh my gosh. This is so beautiful. This is so beautiful, guys. I really like this. This is so beautiful. All right, okay, I'm not gonna spend time on the mascara. Okay, I know you guys are like, okay, let me just forward, fast forward through this one minute mascara thing she's doing over here. I'm sorry. All right. Okay, all right, uh, I don't know. All right, so for blush, I actually have two palettes already from Juvia's Place. Palace, is it Place or Palace? I keep on saying Place, is it Place? Juvia's Place. Um, I have this one. If you want me to do like a bronzy brown tutorial, I, I dip into this during the summer. If you can see this one right here, this is my summer one right here. I'm sorry, my nails, guys, I haven't done my nails. Um, this is the most beautiful um, bronze, but we can do that if you guys want one. Let me know, and we'll do a, um, a uh, tutorial. So what I want to do with this eye is I want to keep it really neutral. So I'm going to use that as a blush, this Yara brown. I'm going to mix it with this so that it's kind of like a brownie, a deep brown pink. I don't want it to be too rosy. I just want it to be like a subtle kiss of pink. See that? Look at me out here doing makeup. <laughs> oh gosh. Um, I'm gonna do a nude lip, guys. I am, I am that I am. What nude lip should I give you today? I'm going to give you, can't get away from my NARS. I need to find my sharpener. I'm gonna give you, Pat McGrath, this is, I think this is 1995. Pat McGrath, 1995. I'm gonna give you a matte lip, no gloss today. Oh, I say that, but then I love gloss. I love gloss, I need gloss. I love a glossy lip, I'm sorry, I gotta give you a glossy lip. But I'm not gonna give you like gloss gloss. I'm gonna give you, this is um, Fenty Gloss Balm. I don't know which one this is. This is the original Fenty Glow. This is so good. This is Riley's favorite. She steals this. Oh, okay. I need a wet lip, okay? I can't help it. I love a glossy lip. Okay. How did we do? Let's come close. We did. Oh gosh, I need to do my last my eyebrows. Look at that big old patch of hair. Oh lord, let me go and take care of that right now. But otherwise, I think we can tell, right? Pigment wise, this is this look was really great. But as far as like the pigment and the color payoff, the Juvia's place, and that's why that's why I got it. That's why I got it is because all the looks that I was seeing, I was like that color payoff is amazing so once again this is the Zulu palette I will leave a link for it um, in the description in the description box but I really I'm really really pleased um, so we're probably gonna do a few more looks with this especially during the summer this yellow and this orange I'm out here getting free y'all all right be safe let's play whatever the, you guys know we've talked about this makeup is how I play and this keeps me calm. This 
revitalizes me. This takes my mind off of what's going on in the world, even if just for 20 minutes. I thank you guys for joining me. I know that this is not my regular scheduled programming. I know a lot of you may follow me for my hauls, but this is part of my, this is actually more of a part of my life than my hauls. Makeup is my first love, always, always, always and forever. And so I'm very proud of myself for like jumping in the deep end. I may go somewhere. I may go from the kitchen to the living room today. Yes. All right. Have fun. Stay safe and just play. All right. Praying for you always. Bye.